Hi everyone, I'm Kiki. Welcome back and welcome to my channel. Today I have a quick saison unboxing to share with all of you. For those of you who haven't watched my channel before, welcome. And uh, for those of you who have, you may or may not know that Cezanne is one of my favorite clothing brands. They're super, super popular. And they used to not send uh, or ship to Canada without you having to pay a lot of duties and taxes, which I hated, which kind of limited what I bought. And now, apparently, I haven't shopped with them for quite a few months, they ship to Canada without uh, extra duties and taxes. It's already included when you check out, which is wonderful because then you just kind of know what to expect price-wise for your entire thing, and which also means that uh, returns are much easier because before I would just keep my things because I had to pay duties already. I just didn't want to return, even if the item didn't work for me. But anyway, without further ado, let us get into it. Here is the beautiful packaging. I always love Cezanne packaging. It is impeccable. Do, 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 Welcome to Kiki's channel. Do, do. Ding, ding. Here are the clothing items. I'm going to put it aside for now and show you the other extras in here. Um, I think there's a little like postcard. I got made. I think I wrote like Happy Mother's Day, your prepaid return label, if I need that. And then, oh my gosh, with this included, I noticed um, when they did my order that they had this and I'm like, wait, I didn't order that. And then they had $0 next to the cost. And I think it's one of their like free tote bags. Just super, super nice. Love that they usually almost always include like a free gift because you know what? Cezanne's really expensive. And I, I do appreciate that. And because I am like a bag lover, especially like things that hold things. Like honestly, like I love canvas bags too. So super cute. And they had a blue version and a pink version. I'm so glad I was randomly allocated the pink version, which would be would have been my first choice. So super happy about that. Let me put that away. And let's get into the clothing items. So I ordered, I think from this one, I ordered a bunch of things, but I think I ordered them all like separately not at the same on the same day at the same time first item i got is dang dang, this is the oh gosh i forgot the name uh da, 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 i think it says on here the brie sweater and i've wanted the sweater for so long finally jumped uh what's it called again oh uh, English. But anyway, finally got it. I got it in a size extra small. I was debating between an extra small or double extra small, but usually in Cezanne, I get extra small for a bit of an oversized look because they fit very, very large. Um, this is made of 100% cotton. I don't know which country it was made in. I feel like this one was Italy. Correct me if I'm wrong. Yes, 100% cotton. And I felt like it would be a really good transitional sweater, the kind of all season sweater. You could wear it in the spring, because as you know, it's still freezing here in Canada. And I thought that like, you know, with thermal layers underneath, I could probably wear it into fall, winter, that kind of thing. So here it is. I'll do a try on later for all of you guys. And dun dun, so excited for this. I've been wanting this forever. I have the, the navy one, sorry, one second. All right, so I already own this in the Ecru and Navy Stripe. It is my favorite sweater from Cezanne. I have a few, um, but it's just such a workhorse. I feel like it's an all season sweater. It's a very heavy organic cotton sweater. So there's a weight to it. It feels really like durable, if that makes sense. And I'll definitely give this a try for you guys, but I was so excited when I saw it and it's been out for ages, I think. Um, that they had it with the brown stripe. I feel like it's just a really good piece. Sometimes though, I will say that there are these little cotton bits. Oh, wait, this one came out. But a few that stick out of um, my other older one, you know, just from washing and wearing in life and then dogs scratching. And you can easily just pull it back in and it's like good as new kind of thing. So I feel like durability wise, I mean, it's expensive. I don't remember it being this expensive when I ordered my first one, but I still think it's worth it just for how much wear I get out of it. So really excited to try this one on. I want to point out that there were a couple, not loose threads, but like they could have snipped these threads over here. I don't know if you can see, and I can do that easily, but I just wanted to point that out. At this price point, I really wish they would have slightly better quality control, but 
it's not a big thing, but I do want to point that out in case that is something that would bother you. I don't think it would bother most people, but just in case. So now I have the Brie sweater on. What do you guys think? I love the slightly like lantern balloon sleeves. I got it an extra small. And this is what it looks like on me. I am around five feet four, 163, 162 centimeters ish. Depends and on the slim side. So this is how it falls. I like to usually wear my uh, leotine and I guess I'm gonna do it with this too. Um, this Brie sweater with the buttons open. I just love the button detailing. It's kind of like that tortoise shell, the same as uh, the leotine. Basically, this is like the leotine sweater, um, but slightly more fitted in the body and with a cable knit, which is just so great. And like, a neutral like you just can't go wrong 100 organic cotton great neutral accru it's not like a harsh white goes with everything i'm actually wearing um cezanne jeans as well these are their what's it called brute b-r-u-t sexy jeans however they're a little large for me because i got them in size 25 which is too big for me but i wanted a not tight fit like it's supposed to be a tight straight leg um like kind of like that but I thought that would be a bit uncomfortable, so I wanted a bit looser. So I sized up. So this is a size 25 Brute Sexy jean from Cezanne. The quality is amazing, 100% cotton jeans. Got this ages ago, but it's a staple. It's one of their um, best-selling jeans. So this is what this looks like on me, and I can like tuck it in for a different, like a French tuck. There we go. I could, must, I could like, you know, fuss with it a little more, but that's what it looks like. Very, very comfy, I think. And let's try the next one on. All right, so this is my Leotine jumper in a crew and camel. I feel like the camel makes it a little bit like softer, if that makes sense, than the navy. It stands out slightly less. And I mean, don't get me wrong, I don't think everyone needs both but I really, really love this sweater. So I think having two to kind of rotate between just helps keep the wear down. And honestly, if it's an excuse, I just love the brown. Like honestly, it is so cute. And because I have so many handbags and accessories in like neutral brown type, I feel like it would go so well with that as well as like shorts or like skirts that are more um, warm toned. I feel like this would go really well. You can wear this tucked in as well. Though I will say that because this, this sweater is not very long, it's more of a cropped oversized, it may or may not uh, tuck in very well for you depending on your torso length. It hasn't been too bad for me. I, t I have a little bit of a, like on the shorter end, my torso's on the shorter end of the spectrum, I would say. So it hasn't um, been an issue for me, but I would say because it's just long enough for me, I don't think it would be it would work necessarily for everyone, depending on whether or not you size up or down. If you size down, I would say it'd be trickier. If you size up, I think maybe less of a problem. I wonder how much more length they would give. If you size up, I haven't tried it in another size other than extra small, so I don't really know. But here's what it looks like on me. It's an oversized fit for sure. Love it. And I'm gonna show you what it looks like with my, dun dun. <laughs> Bonjour toe. Here we go. What do you guys think? If you guys have any questions about Cezanne, the fit, these items in particular, what I feel about the brand, or you have any suggestions for any new videos, I would love to hear from you. Please comment below. And please do give this video a like. It would help me out so much. It would help the small channel and I'd be really, really grateful. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell button to be notified whenever I upload new videos. And I will see you guys next time. Bye, bye. Jenny! Jenny! Thanks for watching! Come again! Bye bye!